Minister of Legal Affairs Bassa Williams declared during a media conference yesterday that Carvel Duncan's suspension from three constitutional bodies were administratively appropriate. If you have a criminal offense and you're working with an employer, the employer doesn't have to wait to see whether you're convicted before the employer could decide whether you are good for his employment or not. Because if they administratively you could proceed. Williams explained that in Guyana, when a public servant is charged with any offense, that person is interdicted, meaning he can no longer function as chairman of the Public Service Commission or be a member of the Judicial nor the Police Service Commission. These bodies are responsible for, among other things, penalizing errant public servants. How could you be interdicted and a person who is supposed to be supervising you is charged and they don't suffer the same consequence. What kind of country do we have? It's the same thing I keep talking about. We're trying to create some super class in this country and see other people in Ghana's grass. Duncan is currently charged with stealing over $900,000 from the Ghana Power and Light. A tribunal was recently set up to investigate whether Duncan should be removed from his constitutional posts because of these charges. That was recently blocked by a high court order handed down by Justice Franklin Holder. And we don't have to wait for no criminal uh, matter to be completed to move administratively against anybody. That's always been the rule. The high court order stated that the tribunal was set up by President David Granger following what was seen as unconstitutional advice given to him by Prime Minister Moses Nagamutu. After several months, the case is that they never received the notice from the Prime Minister. Um, it means then that if it is shown that they received the notice, that's the end of the case. Y'all follow me? Now you know the Prime Minister is a lawyer. You know if you're dealing with certain things. You have to ensure that you have a record. Duncan is being represented by former Attorney General and senior member of the main opposition, Anil Nandlal. 